very much. We are back from the recess. I will join you here again. And our commentaries get. You are getting us live using the global multimedia TV. Thank you very much for getting us back in the second half of commentary. And in the first half, it was amazing and superb. With me in the studios, Musa Santigi Camera, and I'm here with my match analyzers. Of course, more is to of course, welcome back. And and I am Edgisa Jerry. Edgisa Jerry, it has been a very fantastic match in the first 45 minutes. And definitely we are here for the second 45 minutes so far to take you through in this encounter. But don't forget, Awesome Stars are leading here by two goals to nil against Juansin Football Club. And you want him being the host in this particular encounter. Definitely, the Watson boys, they are highly spirited, they are highly determined, and highly motivated because the fans are all over the pitch. And the stadium is jam packed, full of Watson Star supporters. This is Mami Kema, Musa Mansare, biologically known. His popular known Mami Kema, Yuansin, they are desperate, looking for the consolation goal before thinking of an equalizing because they are losing by two goals to nil. And Omaro, what was the take so far? Was themselves in the first 25 minutes, they got 2 0. And now, in the second 45 minutes, they've started beautifully. What are you expecting so far? Uh, of course, my question is, Awesome Stars only need to focus and, of course, uh, hold the game. And, of course, try for them to register their first three points in this 2020-2021 season. I remember what we saw uh, a few uh, days ago when they played against FC Cologne. Ten minutes to game, we see the Paleza, uh, of course, uh, from FC Cologne. And yet today, we want to see Awesome Stars uh, putting their house in order. And, of course, so that to actually register their first three points of the season. Definitely. And that's what the fans keep anticipating for. The fans, all what they want now for Awesome Stars is the three points, not the one point, or talk less of losing a point. And that's the more reason why the fans, these fans that are present in the National Stadium here, they are just a minute by size. They would have come in a very good number more than this, but because... Wasm Stars, they registered two home um, draw. They drew two of their matches at home. And the away, this, this is the first away match so far for Wasm Stars. And they've started winning with two goals already. Should this match end this way, you know, the fans will definitely have confidence and trust in them that their boys are very much good when it comes to away matches. Maybe you know, they will keep following them in the Chinese number. Definitely. In the very first match we are against Axlav, the um, fans we are saying assume stars are the underdogs. Even even the, the Bombalians and also the northern the northerners we are saying assume stars need to add more players, especially strikers and midfielders. And the second match also they were having a lot of commendation. The third match they are making gradual progress. That tells you they are very, they are really, really prepared and determined for them to go through the league. And it looks like they, they, they keep, um, they, they, they keep learning from their mistakes because every other match they made mistakes. The first match they failed to register goal. The second match they registered a goal, and later that goal was um overturn, which ended the match one all. And in today's encounter, due to the past mistakes they made and they learned the lesson. Because the coaches, we are highly humiliated. The coaches, we are embarrassed. And some players, we are also embarrassed. But in today's match, it's a different narrative altogether. Definitely. Within the very first 45 minutes of action, scoring two goals from Osum Stars, nine years of the Premier League. That tells you they are prepared anything. Nice on. Nice build up. FC1 Sin Ball, luggish and a careless from the strikers of FC UNC. Telling you for sure, the side of Osum Stars are putting all what they could for them to see themselves sustainable in the league. Remember, if the game happens to end like this, Osum Stars will catapult in a very comfortable uh, position as they will be having five points and the side of FC UNC will be having their normal four points. Yeah, definitely. And that's more reason why the boys are highly spirited. That's more reason why the fans are highly motivated, they keep cheering up their players, they keep chanting, and they keep singing for the players in order for them to keep putting on good performances. 
here at the National Stadium is Wazom Stars 2, Johansson Neil Sema, Jason Wydia, Michael Carrick, Molai Kamara, biologically known, but he's been brought down the pitch. That was a wrong tackle from the back for Molai Kamara, but it's back on his leg for the continuation of the match. Paul Kamara has to take that free kick deep down the center from the right hand side here in the commentary. Sema succeeded in getting that one beautifully. He collected, but throw him towards himself again. More like Kamara to take the throw. He is Michael Carrick, popularly known. He joined Wasm Stars from Ocean Boys Football Club at the time when Ocean Boys defeated Wasm Stars in the FA Cup. And that was the time the majority of the Ocean Boys players were incorporated into the Wasm Stars squad. The likes of Molai Kamara, the likes of Musa Mansare, Mamikema, and now also Ibrahim Sise, popularly known Tormento, has just been joined into the squad of Wasm Stars. He's also coming from Ocean Boys. And it tells you how the teams we are definitely putting on good and amazing performance in the Northern region, Bombali District. And just like when Gino AFC was once incorporated into the Wasm Stars family, that was where they they spotted boys like Paul Kamara, who has been one of the most consistent players for Wasm Stars Football Club. And the back line for Wasm Stars is one of the sensitive defenders for Wasm Stars in his street jersey, Paul Kamara, who is popularly known as Ramirez. And also, that was in Junior FC, that was a side they, they, they get a player like Saidu Mansare. Mohamed Kesi say Kofi the magician. Maybe he will be injected into the squad at any time. This was some stars to Yuan Sinil. Suleiman Kagbo says chasing wide. His father is outside watching. Hazard. Wasm Sars coming in deep. Daddy Buya. Now negotiating. Looking for his teammates. My good God. This could be a chance. I couldn't believe it. Hazard, that was a misdirection. For the young man in St. Jersey. He's popular on Hazard. Biologically known Ibrahim Kabo. That was a golden opportunity to have St. Wasm Sars three on a score chart. And that will have put them comfortable in this match. And that was a beautiful shot. Rocket one for the big man Hazard. It sends it in the right direction. But the boy sky the ball sky rocketed. And it was a goal kick for the side of FC UNC. Definitely. You want to see they got to be careful. And tomorrow, um, you want to see they, they, they keep receiving pressure. Do Wasm Stars there on top of situation. One could say Wasm Stars would have just sealed the play here. Keep on um, procrastinating um, time, wasting the play, and uh, maybe playing them off defensive rather than attacking. But Wasm Stars, we are seeing them playing that kind of open um, game here tonight. They are not playing them off defense, and they keep putting pressure on the side of Yuansi. It tells you they want to register more goals. Remember, uh, Mami Kamara Dalibuya has just received his first yellow card for. Uh, Playing a foul against uh, FC Yuansi, that is the first card of the match so far. And Mami Kamara Dadibuya, the goal scorer, goes in stars. And it tells you that Dadibuya is so desperate for goals. He wants to compete the likes of Musa Noah Kamara in terms of goal scoring. And that's the more reason why he's active and hyperactive also. It's a corner. Hey. That's a chance! You want him corner, they came close to score. The man in seven jersey for you see. That would have been a lovely opportunity for them to get a consolation at the early time and the second 45 minutes. They came close to score. You want him. When they are on the offensive, they are so desperate. And in football, when the jungle is mature, relationship is far. No friends in it. 
Somento is just so familiar for the continuation of the match. My good goal! There's a chance, a golden opportunity for Johansson. The ball hits the crossbar. Johansson came close to score. The consolation goal. Muslim has got to be careful. SS coming in deep. Still SS up here. It's a player to watch. You need Suleiman Kagbo, more player known SS. He's indeed a player to watch. He has marketed himself. I keep on telling you, Suleiman Kagbo will definitely be the likes of Musa Tombo. Not in the other record, but in terms of playing, in terms of implementing his tricks in the pitch of play. Definitely, SS has been doing extremely well. That is indeed a very fascinating moment for the side of Osom Stars. I think the, the technical side will say that that is a good decision. Signing the big man from Koteyu, nice shots. Power one there from the side of Osom Stars. And, uh, our people of Mbali uh, sometimes refer uh, SS to uh, of, uh, Musa Tumbo. The name is uh, actually one. Uh, actually, uh, uh, for fans, not to call him that name because he is Suleiman Kagbo SS. He has actually been in the position despite uh, the, the skipper and um, Babari is absent from the squad. But SS has actually been a top of the situation at the moment. People from the other part of Saga will give far SS to that Yeah, definitely. Um, but maybe the majority. Yeah, but the majority of the fans, and maybe all, almost all the fans, they are not looking up to him like. The kind of record Musa Tombo has in his career, but rather the football record in terms of when he is in the pitch, is that kind of fierce attacker, is that kind of attacker to record with in the country's football. He's FT, he's mentally intelligent. Hey. You want son? There's a foul. They already put the ball at the back of the net, but after a foul being played, SS chasing wide, but the goalkeeper got that one beautifully. Buya, Kaik, fair play, BJ. He is now suffering. He's suffering pain. And he's gone down. He's Brian Majalo. And he's the team captain for Wilson Stars. He has been very much instrumental on the back line here. I wonder if he goes off the pitch, what will happen to the Wilson boys? This is not the right time that BJ. Would have loved to leave the pitch, but maybe because of injury, he will definitely have to. And remember, the first match, he was part of the squad against Arslav. We are in a put on an amazing performance, and he picks up an injury. The second match, due to injury, he wasn't part of the squad. Dennis Camara for Yuansin has been injected into the squad and he sacrificed a player in 15 for Dennis Camara. And he's looking forward to have a beautiful result at home. But what some stars have turned that one, they threw them wrong. BJ is out. The physio are now looking into his case. A tangled. He's up his legs. He's up his legs. Coming close into the chalk line. Maybe for a continuation of the match. This is the time the Wilson Stars supporters needed you most. Johansson coming in deep in the center pack. Crossover. You should indeed never, never estimate, underestimate your opponent. Because you can't tell what a 90 minutes have in every match. The physio was himself made it. He's DMX. Very much active. And he's one of the renowned 
medical officer we have in the country. That was Ibrahim Sisi, Tormentor, they call him. Karik clears the ball off. SS chasing wide. And the referee keep implementing his tricks, interpreting. You want see they are everywhere in the pitch. Muslim stars, they keep looking for the ball now. Possession in the second 45 minutes seems to be hey, on the side of you want see. SS is just like any Musa Tumbu, I keep telling you. He's a player you got to be afraid of. He's a player we got to set an eyes on. Is definitely going to make his breakthrough in the country's top flight league. And today he has just started registering his Premier League goal. And this is his first official goal for Wassum Stars Football Club. Despite the goals he has been registering on the training session. Officially, this is his first Premier League goal. But Daddy Bia on the other side. This is also his first Premier League goal for Wassum Stars Football Club. Though he has been scoring lots and lots of goals for Wassum Stars in several other competitions. That was Hazard, Ibrahim Kabu, Malian, chasing the Kema, policing the play there. Beautiful defense being put up by Musa Mansari. Is Mami Kema, the free kick specialist from Bombali. And he's on the side of the Wilson boys. Hazard. He's coming in deep. This is Sema Kamara, the young lad from Lungi. Mami Kema. Paul Kamara. Kema clearing that one beautifully. Sema. Connecting the other Dibuya. The Wosun boys now coming in deep. The fans are highly motivated due to the performance being put up by the Wosun boys. Coach Abdurrahman Ture Ajina is yeah. just too happy and he's on the touch line waiting for the end of the match because all what the fans of what's